Okay, the car has passed, so yeah, it is. Okay, my mistake. I thought that the uh, apartment building tower will be closer to the street and I thought that it's, you know, the old one. But no, it's the new one. So in front there will be a big grocery store, convenience store, Lidl. Okay, nice for them. And across the road they have Tivoli Park, some greenery among the asphalt city, concrete city. Yeah, what a mistake I to make. Hello, hello. So, so yeah, basically, um, you know, when I am working, you know, on my articles, projects, or whatever, or just, um, you know, arranging archival documents, usually on, on computer and so forth, you know, downloading, um, editing the photos I took in archive I usually have in the background you know some sort of let's say distraction you know in when I was in Austria I had a lot of you know YouTube looking different channels different subscribers that have channels usually I also do this here but um, you know, from time to time I have an inkling to re-watch some TV shows from my, let's say, childhood, high school years, gymnasium years. And basically for the last month or so, okay, we will be back. Evidence collected. Um, so yeah, for the last month or so. Ah, so it's the same one, Bella. Five years old. Shy. Yeah, Lisa sees those dogs all over there. Punta, yeah, yeah, punta, yeah. Um, so yeah, for the last month or so, I decided to go, you know, honoring some of uh, the Australian subscribers and viewers going through the memories of some Some of the Australian TV shows that I liked when I was a kid, well, younger. So, um, last week or so I finished with the uh, Sea Patrol, so one of the, let's say, newer shows that I used to watch, being very fond of. And currently I am going, I'm on the season 3 of Blue Healers. So yeah, it was quite surprising, you know, how many Australian TV shows we got in the past, you know, pre-digital age. Perhaps I will then uh, continue on with uh, McLeod's Daughters. Yeah, that was also one of the longer that I watched. But the only um, TV show from Australia, which was basically one, one of my favorites. Um, and Lisa, yeah, there was a... Tuki, Tuki, Griva. Pretty, some, some. 
there was a mosquito on my eyebrow. Um, the only, let's say, TV show that I cannot get um, hold of in this digital age are water rats. You know, Sydney Harbour Water Patrol Police. Yeah, that was basically one of the favorite police procedure, procedural TV shows that I liked. You know, besides, let's say, The Shield and NYPD Blue. Yeah. You know, and usually I have, um, let's say, two-thirds of my screen, screen are dedicated to work stuff. You know, the, usually I have one Word document opened that the takes majority of the screen. And then I have, you know, in the top right corner, a little window, a little window to, let's say, watch the shows, which I usually even don't watch because, you know, I have some document that I'm reading on the right side that goes, of course, you know, on top of the above surpasses that obscures I call it, that would be obscures the actual video what is wrong Once again, she's uh, tail down, ears up, head up. Pretty griva, and there is no one there. So yeah, this um, this used to be a skate area, you know, roller skating, and then. They build the obstacle course, <laughs> the track. Pretty easy, guys in a robe. I don't know what is wrong. There is no one here. No dog, no danger. Oh, there is a dog. But you wouldn't be this scared for that one. A pupper. Oh, there are two dogs that she was interested. I didn't see it. Done. Mede, si prevohala enga zde te druzga. Moje mater dečo tog da. Je že zaljubljen. Eko, mamo. Liza, ne moraš ga imeti, ni tvoj tvoj, ni tvoj tvoj. Ja, zanimiv, ja, zanimiv je, zelo dobro diši. Eko. Ok. The guy was already in love with Liza. Oh, so, this guy is inspecting the trees. Not interested in her. So in the winter time if there is snow, this is nice 
sledding area. So one time, you know, especially the, the upper section up, up there below the forest. One time I managed to hit my teacher when sledding. She was too close to the track. We there was four of us on a very large sled that we had that that time. You know the wood like completely wooden one, of course with the metal rails. I don't know what would be correct word for the metal bottom thingies. You know, we had too much of the speed and the snow was actually quite icy and I was in front, I couldn't steer and the teacher was, let's say, hit with pretty in good force. Fortunately, nothing was wrong, no broken bones. Most likely she, she was hurting the next day. But yeah. yeah, quite a lot of number of people in the park. And as I said before, Lisa knows the route. to the city center to store okay I will stop let's say on this point we will go uh, down to the underpass and emerge on the other side of the tracks so yeah more to come very very soon